Okay, and boys, today I'll be doing a player analysis on the new Frank Ribery card, and we will be telling you at the end of this video whether it is worth the massive price, and we'll be also deciding sort of whether it's a good card and stuff, so make sure you watch all the way through for that, i make it as much convenient, and we'll jump straight into it here then, so Ribery is 5 foot 7, high medium, 5 star, 5 star, right footed and explosive, so a very, very nice start, they're pretty much the best you can get, you can play left wing or left mid, so no right wing there, um, so that's a bit annoying, but obviously you know they could play right wing in real life because there was always a Wesley Schneider there, I think. Um, Alright, let's have a look at his stats then here. So we got very, very good pace there, insanely good pace. Decent shooting, I'd say good shooting, um, but not insane. It's just pretty good. It's, it's good for a great for a winger. Uh, insanely good passing, that's really, really nice. And dribbling as well is insane. Pretty bad defending. Um, for a winger there, but it doesn't matter too much. And pretty bad physicality as well, but he still looks insane. Play styles we've got for Nest Shot Plus, Dead Ball, Incisive Pass, Technical Plus, Flair, Traveller, and Quick Step. So, obviously, insanely good card, boys. Let's have a look at the price here. So, for obviously, we've got our Bronze Rare, Silver Rare squad, and then we've got an 83 for the loan. Uh, we've got an 86 with a team of the week, 87, 87, 87, 87 with a team of the week, 88, 88, 88 with a team of the week, 89, 80, 90, and 90. Um, I can't lie, lads. It's not, like, insanely expensive. Obviously, like, you've got Janola, who is stupidly expensive, and that's much more, uh, well, not really much more, but it's a couple squads more than Ribery. And I'd say Ribery is clear. So if you're judging off that basis, then obviously he's worth it. If you're watching this video and you do want to, you know, complete him, then obviously I would only say complete him if he 100% gets in your team and he gets in your team for ages because there's no way you want to be putting all this stuff in for him to sit on the bench in a couple of weeks' time when we get, like, team of the season or something. Um, I Yeah, I me personally, I'm going to avoid this one. But it's, it's an insane card. 